<clears throat> Alright, hello guys. So, I am doing the 360 Max of Reset tutorial. Uh, just before we do get into it though, I just want to say a couple of things. Is that this mechanic is extremely difficult. It's probably the most hardest mechanics I think I've ever learned in my 5,000 hours of Rocket League. This is going to take some time for you guys to master. So don't get too frustrated if you don't get it first try. Uh, another thing is that... Um, Square Dead Zone will help a lot in this. If you are on console, or you can't go to Square Dead Zone, um, it is still doable. It's just that it won't look as clean. Um, well, that's in my opinion, anyways. But um, the Square Dead Zone will really help in this. But yeah, no, before we get into it, let's take out today's sponsor. This video is sponsored by Lolga. Uh, they buy also any item, uh, Rocket League item you want. When you do so, uh, purchase your items, though. Make sure you do use my coupon code JXSH for a 6% off. They are very fast and very cheap and reliable for their services as by the reviews here. Uh, so make sure you do click in the link in the description down below and check out and check out Logger. Uh, let's get straight into the video guys. Thank you. Okay, so <clears throat> so what you need to do, you have to get your car in the in the position to do the 360 max of reset position. Uh, position? Um, 360 max of reset. So what you need to do, I can't really describe it on the ground because it's really, really weird. I don't know how you do it on the ground, but... But you want to get your car in this position like this. You always want to get into that position. If you don't, or if you don't, then it's going to be pretty difficult. But it depends how well you actually do the flip cancel. But well, that's what you're doing. You're just getting your, <clears throat> you're just getting the front of your car basically pointing towards you like this, and a little bit, a little bit facing up like this as well, facing towards you, and your car is pointing up just a little bit. That's what you want in order to get um, the position like this. And there you go, bang, 360 max. Up. So get used to doing that position, and then um, yeah, once you get consistent at that, then try and do this so now this is where things get pretty difficult now so what I want you guys to do you're basically doing a back foot cancel but instead of going to 12 o'clock you are going to 1 o'clock or 11 o'clock so you want to go to either of them I use arrow left so I'm going to top right like this and there you go so you're going to go from 6 to 1 like this if your flip doesn't look like this you're doing it wrong it needs to be looking like this And there you go. Get consistent in that. Add a little bit of error left. All right. And your car should be looking like that. Oh. But yeah, that's what you need to do. So now if you apply all of them steps together, getting yourself to the 360 max of reset position, and then you do that flip cancel. There you go. That's the, that. Obviously, it's not as just easy as that, guys. I'm not saying this is really easy, but this is not easy as that. But that's what you. That's what you need to do. That's all there is to it. And depending on how well you flip cancel as well, you can get like more tighter flip cancels. Maybe I don't know. We got worded here, but you can flip like from a more awkward position and still get the reset. Uh, people call this like. I don't know, the, the, the backwards jacksy reset or the backwards heli reset flip thing. I, I don't fucking know what it's called. But but yeah, that's what you're looking for there. Um, if you guys have any more questions down below, um, down below. if you guys have any more questions, um, I'll, I'll check the comments and try to answer as best as I can. But if you put them two together, that's all you need. That's literally all you need to do. But yeah, and I hope you guys um, hope this hope this tutorial helped. And yeah, have a good one. <laughs> 